Hi guys, welcome to the new Tutu Chic vlog of the week. For the new vlog this week we collected all your questions in a Q&A. So keep on watching to get all your questions about Freya and Tutu Chic answered. From the beginnings, when I was very young, um, me and my parents, we always went to friends of ours, the People of the Labyrinth. It's a design label from Holland. I, I thought it was amazing to see all these things, how they designed it, the colors, how they worked, that they went to Paris. For me, it was an, an, an amazing thought to do that myself. And that's why I, uh, I always got a big dream to become a designer. My favorite piece of my collection, hmm, I've got a lot of pieces that I like, but if I have to, to, to choose something, I will uh, definitely choose one of my handmade knits. Um, the very first one was a present of my mom. Uh, as you all know, she knits the, all the collections with the, the big cardigans. Uh, so the very first one is my favorite piece. Uh, it's a multicolored one. Um, with black. We always have busy times. Um, from the morning when we wake up till we go to bed, uh, it's always very, very busy. Um, and, but now I got the opportunity uh, to expand the brand and I have an amazing team um, that helps me out to, uh, to get everything done. And I have a good planning and uh, that's the most important thing. Uh, the most important life lesson, that would be definitely for me, if you work hard, you can pursue your dreams and if you go for it, you can achieve it. I think that's the most important life lesson that I have learned. The most random fact, I think that's obvious. I like pink. Um, People see me as Barbie and um, yeah, I can, I can deny it, it's true, I'm kind of Barbie, but um, I think that for me it's a big new thing that nowadays they don't see me as a stupid Barbie, they see me more like a lady boss uh, than just a Barbie girl who likes to go out and do her hair being blonde and pink. In weekends, I love to, to do things with Jonas. Most of the time we do impulsive things. I don't like to plan them and I think it's more amusing to do something and just say, okay, let's go. Let's go, for example, to Paris and to have a nice weekend than just plan all the weeks before what we're gonna do. My pet, of course, Fragile is my, my cutest, uh, sweet dog going everywhere with me. Um, no, why the name Fragile? Yeah, I think it's obvious. He's very small, he's so sweet, um, but he isn't that fragile. Uh, in fact, he's very strong. A lot of things makes me happy, but um, most people think that I would be a very material person, but in truth, that's not what I am. I can really be happy with small things. Um, like for example i'm i'm very happy right now how i feel how i am that i'm healthy that my parents are still alive i'm feeling happy and healthy um i have a lover and for me those things are the best things in life uh, this summer the most important colors are as you can see pastel um you, you definitely have to buy uh, one of those sweaters that I'm wearing. Um, they're so comfortable but classy at the same time and of course they're pink. Another piece that I would recommend uh, for this season is of course one of our very long maxi skirts. We have them in blue and pink, hot pink. They're amazing, they're very stylish and they go for, for every occasion. 
My favorite beauty products, definitely La Mer. I know it's very expensive. I think I do six months with one package. So in, in that idea, um, I think it's not that expensive. Um, it's, uh, it's the best product ever. Um, I'm using it for 10 years now. My daily routine. Okay, so I wake up around 7 in the morning and then I do some sports. Or uh, I go for a horse riding with Ocean, um, the best way to start my day. Then I go to the office around 10 in the morning, the girls are there. Then I start doing some office work or um, there I have some appointments around the noon or afternoon. I go visit um, the stores. Uh, sometimes it's the boutique in Antwerp, sometimes it's uh, one of the pop-up uh, pop shops, uh, for the moment the one in uh, Lassen Shopping Center. Later on the day, uh, or I have meetings, or we sit together with the girls to think about a collection or to discuss about production or other things. And then uh, by evening, uh, I go home around between 6 and 7 in the evening. And uh, then Jonas is waiting for me. We make some dinner or we go uh, for dinner together in a restaurant. And I go to bed around uh, very early, around 11, I think. So uh, that's my day. You guys, we are going to end the vlog right here. Thanks for watching and see you guys next week. Bye!